It's Dr. Robert Marvin from Houston, Texas. Uh, I'm a bariatric surgeon. I've been in practice since 2000 and I've seen over 5,000 bariatric patients we've taken care of. We've got a new procedure called the endoscopic sleeve gastroplasty and we're very excited about that. I'm going to tell you now about the technical aspects of that procedure and how it's performed. The procedure is done under a general anesthetic and that's to keep the patient completely comfortable and unaware during the procedure which can sometimes be lengthy. Once the patient's under general anesthetic, we'll place an endoscope down through the mouth into the stomach. The stomach is a large stretchy bag at the front end of the intestinal tract. Its function is to provide capacity for food and store it prior to digestion. When a person eats and adds food to the stomach, it starts to expand. It does this in both a longitudinal direction and a transverse direction with the stretchy part of the stomach being mostly out here in the fundus. When we do the ESG procedure, we place an endoscope into the stomach where then we suture the stomach wall, the front wall to the back wall to pleat the stomach. So we place sutures in a triangular shaped pattern gathering the stomach wall together. After the sutures are placed, the stomach has changed shape. We've gathered the gastric wall in and created the same sort of channel that we see with a laparoscopic sleeve gastrectomy. The stomach can no longer expand longitudinally as it did before, nor can it expand circumferentially. This greatly decreases the capacity of the stomach, the patients feel full a lot faster, and they eat a lot less food.